the music, the people, and even the food. If you haven't guessed it by now, we are talking about the Austin City Limits Music Festival. Tonight ends the two weekend run at Zilker Park, but there's a special group of people that work right alongside the artists. The night beats Tina Shively. She's live at Zilker Park with this unique story tonight. Tina? <laughs> Yeah, Brandon, we're talking about Jo Benfield. She is so amazing. She makes interpreting the music look so easy. You'd never guess what makes her even more unique than her colleagues. The fashion, the food, the photos, all part of what makes the Austin City Limits Music Festival one of the hottest tickets in town. But the number one reason 75,000 people attend every day is the music by artists from Ice Cube to the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Now imagine it all sounded like this. For Joe Banfield, that silence is a reality because she is deaf. So I have residual hearing uh, on my right ear. Joe's turned that small bit of sound she can hear into a career. A lot of it has to do with passion. I love doing this. As ACL's only deaf sign language interpreter. In the weeks before the show, she does a lot of research. The history of the artists themselves, the background that they bring to the music, the song itself that they write, what does that mean? Different people's perspective of the music as listeners. Joe also has a so-called feeder down below her stage in case a technical issue prevents Joe from hearing the lyrics. Female voices sound the most clear to her. This is Joe interpreting on Saturday night at the Tove Low performance, Joe's favorite of 2017. Joe interpreted seven ACL shows this year alone. No small task, even for the most skilled interpreter. Some people are not made for it. Not only is it very physical, it takes mental stamina, too. It's just like a basketball player trying to play baseball or vice versa. Just like me, I have music in my veins. Joe's been interpreting at venues around Austin for four years, but says she's been signing music since I was knee high and doesn't plan on quitting anytime soon. Now, Joe says her dream is to be the next Madonna. I say she certainly has the style and the skill to do it. Reporting live at ACL, Tina Shively, KPU News Weekend Nightbeat. All right, thank you so much, Tina. You know,